Are major gold producers paying much more attention to the juniors now? Joining us today at the Precious Metal Summit is Brett Cook of Exploration Insights. Brett, welcome back to the show. Glad to be here again. Thank so you. are the majors uh, standing up, taking notice of the juniors more so now? I think so. I think the one big change I've seen this year has been the major companies are starting to put a lot more money into the juniors, either by financings or joint ventures. I, mean, I think by mid-year they'd put about $300 million into the juniors. Uh, that's a lot of money in the juniors. And we just saw Kirkland Lake put $56 million into uh, Novo Gold. Uh, we saw uh, Ariana or Arian right. get uh, a bunch of money. So th there's a desire for new projects, new stuff, right? Is that what the main exactly. catalyst is? In-house, they're not finding enough in-house to replace what they're mining. And, that, and they're looking five, ten years down the road, which is the timeline to build a mine. They need to come in and start finding it now. So they're looking at the qualified, excellent right. juniors and putting money into those. So is now the time to get into the juniors? Is this a bye-bye-bye time? Cautiously. <laughs> okay. It's always cautiously. But yeah, I think so. I think um, that's what I'm here for, is looking for the, the few right. companies, the few guys that have got something right. that looks good. Well, look, I see you. You're being pitched constantly. Thousands of companies here. So many projects to kind of sift through. So how do you choose? I'm looking... Joe and I's thesis at Exploration Insights is we want to buy a company that is eventually going to be bought out by a major. So we're looking at it as a major mining company to look at a junior. We want a big district scale project. We want a big system that's capable of producing multi-million ounces high over grade. time. We want grade, high margin, uh, that sort of thing. And so when I'm meeting with a company, the first thing I want to know is, okay, determine, do these guys have a sense of what they're looking for, what it really looks like, what's, what's the hurdle so, they need to break? So kind of what's the first question you ask these guys? Um, well, first is market cap, and then I want to know conceptually what they need to find to be important. And that comes down, and to know that answer, you need to know tons, grade, uh, capex, metallurgy, all those questions you have to have in the back here, you have to know the answer to, or you don't, can't understand the results. At the same time, are you paying attention to the price of gold? I, I look at it every day, but I don't really. It doesn't impact your decision whatsoever? No. No, I, I think more important right now is recognizing that the major mining companies need to replace their reserves. And I don't care what the gold price or zinc price is, they need to replace those reserves. So if I can own the company that finds the highest margin deposit, I don't care. Brad Cook, thank you so much for your thoughts today. Thank you. And thanks for watching our coverage here from the Precious Metal Summit. We'll have much more for you on Kiko.com. Thanks, Brett.